Have you ever considered how much data you generate every day? Every click, every swipe, every digital footprint we leave behind contributes to a vast ocean of data. This data, in essence, is a reflection of our digital existence, our preferences, our habits, our choices. And in today's world, this data is transforming the way we live, the way we work, the way we interact. We are living in an era of digital transformation, a time where data is at the heart of everything we do. More than just numbers and facts, data today tells a story. It provides insights, forecasts, trends and drives our decisions. It's like a compass in a sea of information, guiding us towards informed choices and strategic moves. This is what we call a data-driven world. A world where data is not just collected, but analyzed, understood and used as a powerful tool. A world where data is the foundation for innovation, for growth, for progress. Businesses, big and small, are recognizing the power of data. They are leveraging this power to enhance their operations, to improve their products, to understand their customers better. They are fostering a culture of data, where every decision, every strategy, every action is backed by solid data. But it's not just businesses. Governments, educational institutions, non-profit organizations, all are harnessing the power of data to make a difference. To solve complex problems, to make informed policies, to drive social change. So, let's take a moment to appreciate the power of data. The power to inform, the power to inspire, the power to innovate. The power to transform a simple piece of information into a valuable insight, a strategic decision, a game-changing move. Indeed, in the current era, data is the new oil that fuels our digital economy. And just like oil, the true value of data lies not in its existence, but in our ability to refine it, to understand it, to use it. That's the power of data in today's world. So what exactly do we mean when we say data culture? Well, it's not just about numbers, spreadsheets, or even the latest technology. It's more than that. Data culture is a framework, a philosophy, an ethos that permeates every layer of an organization. It's about creating an environment where data is not just appreciated, but is deeply ingrained in the day-to-day -day activities, the decision-making process, and the strategic direction of a business. In today's digital age, we're swimming in a sea of data. Every click, every swipe, every transaction leaves a digital footprint that, when harnessed correctly, can provide valuable insights. But the key to unlocking this potential lies not just in the data itself, but in the culture that surrounds it. You see, data culture is not a destination, it's a journey. It's a shift in mindset, a change in behavior, a commitment to continuous learning and adaptation. A data culture is about democratizing data breaking down silos and making information accessible to everyone within the organization. It's about fostering a sense of curiosity, encouraging questions and promoting exploration. It's about empowering individuals to use data to drive their decisions and actions, to challenge assumptions and to innovate. But it's also about responsibility. In a data culture, every individual is a data steward, responsible for the quality, privacy, and security of the data they handle. It's about using data ethically, transparently, and responsibly. In essence, a data culture is about people. It's about creating a community of data enthusiasts, a collective of data literate individuals who understand the value of data, who know how to use it, and who are committed to using it to drive progress. So while technology and data are important, it's the people their mindset and their behaviors that truly make a data culture. It's about fostering an environment where data is not just a tool, but a way of life. Data culture then is the backbone of a truly data-driven organization. What are the core principles that define a potent data culture? Let's delve into the four key principles that underpin a thriving data culture. The first principle is data democratization. This is about making data accessible to everyone within an organization, not just the data scientists or IT experts. By breaking down the barriers and silos that often surround data, we empower every team member to utilize data in their everyday tasks. This democratization fosters innovation and creativity as it allows for different perspectives and insights to surface. Our second principle is data literacy. Data literacy is the ability to read, understand, create and communicate data as information. 
Just like being able to read and write was crucial in the past, in our current digital age, data literacy is a must-have skill. It's not just about understanding charts or spreadsheets, but about understanding the story that the data tells and how it can be applied to make better decisions. The third principle is data governance. Now, while we want everyone to have access to data, we also need to ensure that this data is accurate, reliable and secure. Data governance involves setting rules and policies around how data is collected, stored and used, ensuring that data is treated as a valuable and protected asset. Finally, we have data-informed decision-making. This principle is about using data to guide your decision-making process. It involves asking questions, analyzing data and using the insights gained to make more informed decisions. This goes beyond just looking at the numbers, it's about understanding what those numbers mean and how they can inform your strategies and actions. These principles, data democratization, data literacy, data governance and data informed decision making are not standalone. They interlock, each one enabling and enhancing the others, creating a robust and resilient data culture. These principles form the pillars of a successful data culture. They are the foundations that will allow your organization to leverage data effectively, turning it from a raw resource into a powerful tool for growth and innovation. Or what are the elements that comprise a thriving data culture, you might ask? Well, there are four major components that are vital in creating a data culture that truly thrives. Firstly, there's the aspect of having the right tools. In the digital age, we have an assortment of data analysis tools at our disposal. From simple spreadsheets to advanced machine learning algorithms, the right tools can empower employees to make data-driven decisions and foster a culture where data is valued. It's not just about having the tools, but also about ensuring everyone knows how to use them effectively. Secondly, we have skilled personnel. A data culture is only as good as the people who are part of it. It requires individuals who are not only adept at handling data, but also have the ability to interpret and communicate the insights derived from it. These individuals are the data champions who drive the culture forward, making sense of numbers and patterns to inform strategic decisions. The third component is leadership commitment. A strong data culture is often driven from the top. Leaders who understand the value of data and champion its use send a clear signal to the rest of the organization. They set the tone, provide resources and create an environment where using data is the norm rather than the exception. Lastly, but certainly not least, is a culture of curiosity and exploration. A thriving data culture encourages questions, fosters exploration and celebrates learning. It's a culture where it's okay to ask why or how and where diving into the data to find answers is encouraged. It's about creating an environment where data is not just valued, it's exciting. Together, these elements create a data culture that's more than the sum of its parts. The right tools, skilled personnel, leadership commitment and a culture of curiosity and exploration. These components work together to create a holistic data culture. They bring data to life and in doing so, they empower organizations to navigate the complexities of the digital age with confidence and clarity. These components work together to create a holistic data culture. Why should organizations strive to foster a data-driven culture? Now that's a question worth pondering. To answer, let's dive into the compelling benefits of a data-driven culture. First off, it dramatically improves decision-making. By relying on data, organizations can eliminate guesswork and subjectivity from their decision-making processes. They can make informed decisions based on facts and figures, not just hunches and assumptions. For instance, a retail company might use data on customer purchasing habits to determine which products to stock, leading to increased sales. A data-driven culture also boosts operational efficiency. Data can help identify bottlenecks and inefficiencies in processes, allowing organizations to streamline their operations and reduce waste. Consider a manufacturing company that uses data to optimize its production line, reducing downtime and improving productivity. Then there's the enhanced customer experience. In today's digital age, 
Customers expect personalized, seamless experiences. A data-driven culture enables organizations to understand their customers better, tailor their offerings, and exceed customer expectations. Picture a streaming service that uses data to recommend shows based on a viewer's preferences, creating a highly personalized and enjoyable user experience. But perhaps the most significant benefit of a data-driven culture is the competitive advantage it offers. In an increasingly data-saturated world, organizations that can effectively harness and utilize data stand head and shoulders above the rest. They're able to anticipate market trends, innovate more effectively, and stay one step ahead of their competitors. Imagine a tech startup that uses data to predict emerging technology trends, allowing it to innovate and stay ahead in the competitive tech industry. These are just some of the benefits of a data-driven culture. But remember, cultivating such a culture is not a one-off effort. It's a continuous journey. It requires commitment, investment, and most importantly, a shift in mindset towards valuing and utilizing data at all levels of the organization. The benefits of a data-driven culture are indeed transformative. It's time for organizations to embrace this culture and unlock the immense potential that data holds. So, what have we learned about data culture today? In our journey through the digital landscape, we've come to understand the profound significance of data culture in the modern world. We've explored the concept, peeling back the layers to reveal a framework that is as intricate as it is vital. We've discovered that data culture isn't just about numbers and charts, but about people, processes and a shared vision. We've delved into the key principles of data culture, highlighting the importance of transparency, accessibility and quality. We've examined the components that make up a successful data culture, including technology, governance and skills, We've also discussed the immense benefits of fostering a data-driven culture in an organization, from informed decision-making to increased efficiency and innovation. Remember, data culture isn't a destination. It's a journey. A journey of continual learning, adaptation and growth. In the end, a robust data culture is the key to unlocking the true potential of data in your organization.